Lubiza. Whoa, whoa. Oh, God. <laughs> Listen, I can't sing, but she can. It's Lena Kaduzovich. Are you ready to interview her? Let's do this. Lena, honey, welcome back to Junior Eurovision. Thank you. <laughs> now, what are you doing here? Um, well, I really love Junior Eurovision, and I think everybody knows that. So uh, I came here to support everybody and uh, just to show much love and to tell them that they should not be afraid of performing and stuff like that. And to see my old friends. <laughs> I like the way you're bringing that Miss Slovenia element to it. You're here as a charity to tell every contestant not to worry. But looking back, though, now that you're not in it, do you empathize with the nerves and how they're feeling? Um, well, I know how it feels. Like I was a little bit nervous too because it's it's it is a big contest, and uh, I like everybody is afraid that they're going to fail or something. But uh, if you just believe in yourself, everything can come true. And are you sad that Slovenia is not in the contest this year? Actually, yeah, I am sad a lot. And how did your career change? I mean, you were already a big star. Yeah, because she won Slovenia's Got Talent. She beat Maya Coitz. Yeah. <laughs> did, <your junior> <laughs> did Junior Eurovision take you higher? Um, yeah, uh, it did. It, um, uh, like Many people know me now, and uh, like I saw my Instagram grew a lot. Uh, so um, I'm really grateful for all the support that uh, they give me and everything. So Junior Eurovision was like, like a big thing for me, but it gave me a lot of fans and I'm really thankful for that and it's just lovely. How many times have you sung your Junior Eurovision song since then? Oh, I don't know, because then I had like um, performances in Slovenia and I sang it a lot. And I'm going to sing it on uh, 24th of November, I think, again, uh, at, a, at an album. Uh, how, do, how do you say it? Launch? I think, yeah. There is something strange that I feel inside. <laughs> oh, I, my heart was, was never, never broken. broken. <laughs> <laughs> it is such a beautiful number. So, you are the expert at televised contest. You know, you picked up a medal at Junior Eurovision, you won Slovenia's Got Talent. If you were to judge this show, what do you, what would you be looking for in each of the acts? Hmm, no, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, I actually just, um, it's, it's about what they feel inside and how they sing. Like, somebody can sing, like, like you can say, wow, but if they don't sing it from its heart, then it doesn't mean anything to me. Um, so that's one point. The second point is uh, stage presentation, but it's not so important as the message from, from the heart. Uh, like you have to feel the song, you have to live in it because this is like like one moment and then it's not going, never going to happen again. Well, maybe on the bigger revision for them. But um, it's like just a special moment and uh, I don't think they should just be like standing on the stage and doing nothing. They have to show their feelings and that's really it. But I, I, don't, I don't know which one is like the best one because I like all countries are so good. I can't choose the winner. Miss Slovenia indeed. <laughs> and Slovenia is not in the house so you should be able to give... You can't say Slovenia is the best because yeah. it's not in the conversation. Yeah. Now, do you think a junior Eurovision song should be geared towards children or towards adults? Um, actually, to what they feel is the best. And, uh, like, I chose my song because, I don't know, first love is something that everybody has experience with. We all remember how it was. Um, and I just thought it's a a great song like to message people and remind them of when they had their first love maybe they are still with their first love many years ago darling many years ago <laughs> it also was a first love song so it's obviously yeah. a winning theme truly now speaking of first love we have to ask you are you still friends with Misha Smirnov why, why does everybody <laughs> think like come on we're just friends we're like bros and sisters we understand us really good and he's like a really good friend and uh, like I love him as a friend and he supports me and is like just the best friend that I ever found. Like, okay, a boy. <laughs> like a friend that is a boy that I ever found because I have many uh, friends that is a girl in Slovenia and in Russia. Oh. Do you know who else loves and supports you? 
Oh. Your fans on We Weeb Oh, hello! Ball. <laughs> Do you have a message to say to them before we say goodbye? Um, I don't know what to say. Um, because, like, um, I don't know what to say because I, I'm just so thankful. The words aren't enough. Okay. Um, oh, so uh, <laughs> um, hello, um, I'm Lina from Slovenia. I'm just really thankful for all the support that you gave me and for all the fun that you uh, made possible for me. And I just love you a lot. Oh, she is Miss Slovenia. She is a star. She is the winner of Slovenia's Got Talent. She is going to be a future Eurovision contestant. Get the girl a Grammy now. It is Lena Kaduzovic. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Great oh,